the first step of weighing is planning first of all select the balance according to weight if you need below 20 mg weight select the balance micro balance if you need more than 20 mg weight you can use analytical balance as well as top load balance second thing is assemble all the necessary materials for weighing in a tray otherwise your time will be wasted and third final one is select appropriate receiving vessels after planning next step is check the weighing balance first of all we should check the environment it means temperature and humidity should be controlled next step is cleaning means surrounding the balance as well as pan should be cleaned pre checkpoints like silica should be activated balance should be on a horizontal place check the calibration status daily as well as monthly previous logbook entry should be closed and status board should be updated After that next step is weighing procedure there are different three methods of weighing these methods can be used according to nature of the material first one is method 1 for powders method second when the receiving vessels is not teared and third one is method third for liquid and sticky materials these methods are explained in usp chapter 41 and 1251 after weighing some post weighing checkpoints are there first one is cleaning of pan and surroundings no residue remains of previous material on the pan silica should be activated balance should be on a horizontal place calibration status can be checked and logbook entry should be closed status board should be updated